That is perfect. <gasps> He's got it. What the heck? Oh my gosh, there's something big. Something. Oh, I got him on the bridge. Oh, we gotta walk him. Oh my gosh, my heart is racing. Boy, do I have a video in store for you guys. We're gonna be throwing this bad boy. We're gonna be throwing a snake today. I also have a rat with me that we're gonna possibly try out just in case the snake doesn't work. We're gonna be fishing a swamp today. I have never fished a swamp before. I am so excited about it. Let's go ahead and roll this clip real quick. I randomly pulled off into this tiny creek. Look at this. Holy cow. Giant mud fish choked my frog. Oh, that's the biggest mud fish I've ever seen. Oh my gosh. Just destroyed the frog. Oh my gosh, look at that. Giant. Right out here under this bridge. I am shaking right now. Look at that thing. Oh my gosh. So yeah, that's the aftermath of my frog. It's done, brand new. Just tied it on one cast. So what you guys just watched was a giant, giant fish between 15 pounds, super fat in this tiny swamp that's hidden away by a little bridge. I never knew there was actually fish in here. Long story short, I forgot to take a thumbnail of my reel with a frog on it. So I went down there to take a picture. Well, I actually made one cast with my frog and had a giant fish destroy it, literally destroy it, broke the hooks off and everything. And we're going to be going down there today with a snake and a rat fishing this nasty swamp and seeing if we can catch some giant fish. But if you guys are not subscribed already, be sure to hit that subscribe button, hit the like button if you guys have been enjoying the content and also hit the notification bell so to send you post notifications after every single upload. But if you guys have been enjoying the a little bit of it. But if you guys have been enjoying the content, leave a comment down below. But let's go ahead and rig up and get down to this swamp. So this is gonna be some crazy footage today if it actually pans out. Catching big fish on a snake. Are you kidding me, guys? You better share this with each and every one of your friends because also we are close to 200K and I cannot thank you guys enough for that. Just hit 185,000 today. So thankful. Thank you guys so much. It's unbelievable how quick everything's growing and I know we can hit 200K within the next week and a half. If you guys are wondering what knot I'm tying, basic uni knot, that's my go-to knot for just about any bait out there. And I'm throwing this on 65 pound braid. We're gonna be pulling the dinosaurs out of this swamp today. Can we just take a moment and just realize how beautiful this setup is with the snake on? Oof. I'm getting, guys, I'm getting so excited for this video. I am just, I have not been this excited for a video in a while, but look at that. It just matches this. Everything's good to go. This is going to be killer today, boys. We're going to try to hook an enormous fish on the old snake. Let's get it started. So this is the creek with the little swamp that I'm talking about. As you guys can tell, a bunch of lily pads, a bunch of slop and grass on top, and also a bridge, very small area. We can fish the other side as well. I just realized there's so much crap on top. I'm hoping that, you know, the snake's gonna work out. If not, we're gonna have to tie on the rat. I'm sure the rat will do the trick, but man, I am excited. This is something I've never done before. And I'm excited to show you guys. All right, it's time to try out the snake. Make sure it drags tightened, okay. Got this on 65 pound braid, like I was saying. Oh, that was horrible. Oh my gosh, but the snake's action. Oh, guys, I, holy cow, this is, why is my braid doing that? Don't do that to me. No, the snake's gonna get destroyed. I just know a swamp donkey is going to eat this. This is the only problem. Bunch of grass and the nasty slop. It's not even just grass. It's just like 
nasty swampy crap. I think it's about that time we whip out the yappy rat, the yappa rat. Give it a try. See what happens with this thing. First time using the yappa rat. Let's see how it walks. I don't even know how this thing's supposed to. Oh my gosh! Look at the. That's what it's meant for. Holy cow! <laughs> This thing walks amazing. That's exactly why that uh, lip is like that. Oh my gosh, look at how it walks. That is too good. Ooh. Made it to the other side. A little bit more open water, a ton of lily pads. We're gonna be casting under this bridge, also around some of the pads, see if we can attract a fish to come out. Still gonna be throwing the yapparat. We've had a bunch of activity on this thing today, and I really think we're gonna get a big fish on it. Oh yeah. <gasps> He's got it. What the heck? It is a pickerel. Oh my God, he, he broke my rat. He broke my rat. Oh my gosh. He broke my rat. No. Oh my God. <laughs> Dude, there's no way. That's not a pickerel, that's a freaking gar. What am I saying? I freaking got a gar on a rat. I caught a freaking, I caught it on the rat, dude. <laughs> Look at that. All right, let's get a release on this guy. I'm not touching him. If you guys don't know, little tip from Noah, gars smell so bad. Oh, no wonder my rat's paint was chipping off. It was all nasty gar. That is definitely a swamp monster right there. Let's get him back in the water. Oh man, what the, what the heck? I caught a freaking gar. Look at his teeth. Holy cow, look at his teeth, little angry boy. I'm sorry, man. But thank you for biting, needless to say. Good thing I brought pliers, because I am not messing with these guys. It's just not happening. Dude. Dude. <laughs> I caught a freaking gar on a rat. That was sweet, honestly. Let's see if he actually broke my rat. I'm pretty positive he broke it, but there's the hook, there's the rat. Dang it. Let's see if we can fix it. All right, this is not gonna be the easiest thing. Oh, well, or is it gonna be the easiest thing? I think we fixed the rat. <laughs> this thing looks like we've caught at least 100 fish on it already. Tons of scratch marks all over the backside of it. Oh man, let's see if we can catch another one. That was sweet. Like, I don't care what we catch. As long as we're catching fish in the swamp, I'm having a good time. I can tell you one thing, the hooks on the snake are actually really good. Perfect for what we're doing right now. Cause my thing is if I get a bite, I wanna catch them. Cause this is just so different. Strong hooks, green color pattern on the snake. It's gonna be sweet. Look at the yapper rat. Look at that right there. I mean, paint coming off of it. They have tore up the rat today. But we really wanna get one on the snake. I feel like that's gonna happen too. If we put it at the right place at the right time, I think something big is going to eat this snake. That is perfect. Oh my God. One hit it. He hit right behind it, barely missed it. Oh, it's gonna happen. It has to happen. Oh my gosh. My GoPro died, but we're gonna get back in there. That guy slammed the snake. Holy cow, it's gonna happen. Just give me a minute. Oh, oh my gosh. He's still behind it, still behind it. Still behind it. The intensity level on this. All right, it's about time we hit the last corner. We're gonna still go back through all these other ones. We haven't caught enough fish. We gotta see if we can catch some more. We're gonna go on this other side. We are not trying to catch this. Let's take a peep under here, see what there is. Oh, this is creepy, honestly. Look at all the debris right there. 
So it looks like a little beaver dam. It's not though. It's definitely from people um, cutting down oh, trees and stuff. Don't break my snake. We aren't quitters. We're coming back for one more college try. See if we can get them on the rat. I'm bringing it back. I'm sorry, I had to leave the snake behind. It's just hard to get through all this crap, but let's see if we can catch a big fish. Oh my gosh, there's one behind me. There's something. What the heck? He just slammed me. Has to be another gar. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh, I had him. First cast. First legit cast. We gotta get back in there. He destroyed the rat. Uh oh. There's one under me. Yep. Oh, that's a gar. It's a lot more active right now. That's what I was expecting. Early in the morning or right when the sun's coming down. Best for top water, especially during the summertime. Gosh, one just slammed something over there. Oh, we need to get in there. Something. What the heck? What the heck? What the heck? The freaking gar munching. I can I can officially say that. No bass, no mudfish. It looks like all gar biting at this moment. Yep, I'm standing on top of a bridge. Probably not the best thing, but guess what? This is the best way to get in the right spots, I can tell you that. Whoa, no, 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 not today. Oh my gosh, there's some big, some. Oh, I got him on the bridge. Giant mudfish, giant. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Oh, oh, we gotta walk him. Giant mudfish destroyed it. Oh my gosh, my heart is racing. Oh no, he came off. Oh, I should have just brought him into the side. I was toying with him way too much. Oh, oh, from the bridge. Oh, that was amazing, honestly. That's fine. A quick release on him, that is completely fine. That was a giant, too. Anywhere between that 15 pound range. I knew by the wake. I knew by the wake that that was just a giant. That almost looks like the one I caught the other day. He's hiding out in this corner by the lily pads. These cars are going by are probably wondering what in the heck I'm doing. I literally just stood up on the bridge. Oh my gosh, that's insane. Oh. Well, everyone, sadly, that's going to have to end off this video. But if you guys haven't already, be sure to hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button if you guys have been enjoying the content. Let me know if you guys want me to go back here because we could definitely come back here and catch a lot of fish and be throwing baits that we can actually, you know, hook all these fish on. Needless to say, it was worth coming back there the second time, especially getting that big mud fish hooked right off the, the bridge over there. That was just killer. All the cars were looking at me like I was crazy, but... We got the job done. But thank you guys so much for the Thank you guys so much for the support. I love you guys so much. And I'll catch you guys in the next